So, would you look at that? Jurassic World update has landed. Now, I haven't opened this at all, so I don't know whether there's, um, there's, like, actually anything there, or if it's, like, just preparing. So, but I just want to make this video, like, as soon as possible. Um, oh my god, 744! You know, there was a point where I was like, you know what, I should, um, I should download this on my iPhone, so I can do it on the go. Uh, which is probably what a lot of you guys do. But, um, it's pr this game's like 5 gigs, I'm sure. It's probably massive. So, I, I was, oh, I'm really excited, I'm really excited. And I looked at the page, the store page, and there's a mammoth. There's actually, there, uh, maybe that's the only one right now, but there is a mammoth. And on there, um, it looks like, uh, we'll do, we'll see it when we go inside, but it looks like it shows its level 40 form. <laughs> Spoiler warning! Someone actually did manage to get images of the mammoth even before it's released. These hackers are damn good. So I'm just gonna give you a warning right now, just before, like, I put the images up. There's only a few images, so don't worry. If you don't want spoils, look away. There, there it is. It's beautiful. And now, you can turn back. And for the first time, these creatures are gonna have probably less spikes than any of the other creatures in the game. If the level 40 mammoth is anything to go by. And I really like the look of it. If any of you guys remember my Far Cry Primal uh, videos, when there was like, when we had to hunt like an alpha mammoth or whatever it was, they had like blood tusk, I think it was called. Um, so they it, they look like normal creatures, except for a little bit different. Like the level 40 mammoth is white instead of brown. It has some like slashes on its back, so it looks like it's been in battle. And this is new. This is new as well. The new VIP benefits. Keep a good thing going. Continue receiving your VIP benefits. Don't wait. Renew your subscription today. Okay. VIP mystery packs? What? Oh, okay, so we get we get more mystery packs now? Uh, loyalty points times two. DNA production site. That's new. Up to 2,000 DNA every day. Okay. And exclusive content. Oh, guys. Guys, we got too much to do. What's- Oh! And the other- Oh, they're hybrids! Oh, we didn't even realize! Two new aquatic creatures. On Capristis, that's the one! Oh my- Guys, I've done an episode. I have actually done an episode discussing these new aquatics and e new creatures. And, um, that video is now out of date, so... Over the weekend, there's gonna be a video that looks like it's speculation on what these are. <laughs> okay? I couldn't get it out fast enough. So what is Nundagorgosuchus, Metroorphodon, and Dungosaurus. Wow, okay. So, more is always more. VIP subscribers always receive two times loyalty points. So now, if, if you're sick of missing out on VIP dinosaurs and events and stuff like that, apparently, there is now a way to get VIP points called loyalty points. And it should be... Oh, wow. So this is- is this gonna be the glacier place? So screw the volcano! I thought it was gonna be up here! Okay. So... Oh! So if you're a VIP, your mystery pack gets upgraded to a VIP mystery pack. And we've got now an extra tab for, um... Oh no! No, the solid gold pack now costs 10,000! Oh no, I should have opened them when they were only five. Bollocks. Oh, that sucks. I can still open 12, but I could have opened 24. Is there anything, is there anything, any difference? Is there any new creatures? No, there's less. Is there like, what happened to the aquatic VIP? Where's giant orthocone? Where's... Oh. Okay. Damn it, I should have opened them when I had the chance. Bollocks, I didn't think that was gonna happen. Okay, okay, well that's- We're going over a lot of things. Let's see what the VIP mystery pack is and what we get. So usually you get about 10 bucks. You get 30. So, you get a lot more. And we have gold ring- Oh, 15? Times 2 subscriber! 30! Oh, I like it! Oh, that's cool! Uh, I'm pretty happy with that! 
<laughs> okay, so we've got new hybrids. We've got, um... We've got new dinosaurs. Whether they're released or not, I don't know. We'll have a look. Uh, the stars are different. They look like they've got some pixels around the edges. Uh, regular park looks okay. I have taken a hit with my coin because I traded like 24. Ooh, yes, I know. I know what that does. Um, I've been doing it all this time, goddammit. Um, yeah, I traded like 24 million coin for about 4,000 DNA, which isn't really that much. But I can collect, you know, coin like this. I can't collect DNA like this. Or maybe I can now because we have the new building. Where is it? Oh, oh, that's nice that you come up with a little logo to show you they're ready. Okay, where's this building then? Where is it? Where's this VIP get DNA thing? Hold on. Where is it? Yeah, this thing. You wanted it, you got it. VIP receive an upgrade. Uh-huh. Join. Okay, I already have joined. Is this it? It's hot on Isla Nublar. Ready to visit a cooler climate? Oh, it's not construction underway. So we're going to slowly see this glacier exhibit build. And, um... And it's going to start with the mammoth. Ah, oh, cool! I like it. It's a shame what happened to giant, like... The bloody VIP packs. Oh, here it is! The loyalty! My bad. Okay, let's just quickly get some food. Oh, it's been downsized! No, my food production! <laughs> you wonder, you got it. Uh huh, next. So, I've already joined, so do I get those? Oh! Oh, DNA production level one. Full. Fill the progression counter. You must complete the progress counter by collecting DNA before you can upgrade this building. Oh, so I gotta collect two more. Oh, I gotta collect in 12 hours. And then I can upgrade. Jesus, okay. And it costs bucks to upgrade, apparently? Cool, cool. I thought that would be somewhere else. Possibly. I, d I didn't think it was going to take- I mean, yeah, I guess. That that serves as much purpose as the other one. Um, so what battles we got? We got a food! Battle for survival. Only two commons. Um, okay. Wow. Damn! Damn, damn, damn! What a shame! So this is the food pack. And we can't win that. Um, normal packs. Any- any difference? So, the giant author cone. What other- what other things? Sorry, hold on. I'm- I'm being swept away by so much news. Okay, let's go in the VIP. Let's go solid gold. Now, what's there that- what- like, what's gone? Mastodon, Prestitutus, Orthocanthus, Tiny Colosaurus, Tylosaur is there, Apanosaurus, Hanodis, Hainosaur. So, we have Tylosaur and Hainosaur. We have Hanodis. So, the new VIPs, the new ones that came in, Aren't there. Giant Orthocone isn't there. Um, the other flyer, the Sun's Opterus, that's not there. Um, what else isn't there? Is there another land? Let's have a look. Yeah, they're all there. Yeah, this guy's not there anymore. He's gone. Um, oh, and he's also gone as well, the Metaposaurus. Balls! I could have got level 40s of all of them! Damn it! Or at least very close to it. Okay. Hopefully... Should we open one pack? It costs 10,000. Um... Do we get double the VIP points back? Because we're VIP? I want to check. Um... So the loyalty points, I don't know how that works. So if you guys want to leave in the comments how the loyalty points work, because I'm already a VIP, and my VIP... Um... Oh. I don't have, like, a homepage for the VIP anymore. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there it is! The Mammoth! Search! No! Oh, cool! So, it's... It's got its own type. Snows, Savannah, and Caverns! Okay, let's speculate. So, the Snows is almost, like, out on the, um, the Mammoth step. It was out in the wilderness in braving all elements. So in that will be Elasmotherium, the rhino. Um, 
Savannah will probably be things like Sabretooth Cat, Terror Bird. In the caverns will be um, obviously ca cavernous creatures like uh, cave bears. Um, trying to think of anything else. Uh, the cave lion, I think, was another one as well. Um, so there it is. Unlock via special event. So it's gonna be. It is gonna be like the um, the aquatic because it's just like the mosasaur. Sen Cenozoic. Kenozoic. Ken I'd say it's S for that C. Cenozoic market. Aquatic. So they're calling it Cenozoic. They're not calling it Glacier. They called the last one Aquatic because it spanned loads of different periods of time. But I guess... Right. Okay. So how long did the Cenozoic era last for? Because... That means that we're not going to see any giant bugs. And we're not, we may not even see Titanoboa unless that existed in the Cenozoic era. And if Titanoboa um, was in this, would it be a snows or savannah or caverns? It'd probably be a savannah, I'd imagine. Okay. Okay. So, this tournament may not be out yet. It, it could be a possibility that I'm just not seeing it right now. Because that sometimes happens, like, you have to reload the game. I'll do that at the end of the video. And if nothing changes, well, obviously, well, it, it, nothing, nothing changed. So they're not, they're not called VIP points. Oh, okay, loyalty points doesn't, oh! Ooh, 10,000, that's exactly the same amount as a solid gold pack, right? Isn't it? Orthocanthus. So we could buy a VIP pack. And have a chance of getting it. Or we could just do it in the trade harbor. Now that's tempting. But I, you know, I've got 13 packs to open. Chances are one of them is going to be it. And I'll also get VIP points back. So I'm not going to do that because I would just lose out. 50 million for an Indominus? I'm taking that to the bank. <laughs> yeah, I love that. Uh, 7,000 coin, uh, books, I'm okay. So we got an Indominus Rex. That's amazing. Um, okay, that's really good. Um, so, we, oh, I, that's the Ankylodocus I got for, um, coin, and I got this Indominus for food. <laughs> 50 million food, though, it's a lot. It is a lot, and it'll take a long time for me to get back up there. But, let's put in that Indominus Rex. It takes six days. And maybe, um, I'm thinking this will just slowly progress. Like, it'll just get more and more uh, built up. As time goes on, uh, you know, every now and again there'll be an update and there'll be a little bit further progress. It could be. They could do that. It would be cool if, like, the crane was moving and the digger was digging and the van was vanning. That would be really cool <laughs> if that was the case. Um... But it's nice that it's there and it's it's sort of showing us where it's going to be. They've they've also fixed some issues. I can't remember what it was with, though. It was in the update. Hold on. Let, let's have a quick look on the update. Yeah, so here we go. Uh, oh, no, it's a description. Here we go. What's new? So, hate missing out. Now all players now earn loyalty points. Use your points to purchase limited card packs, items, and more. So now no longer is anything VIP exclusive. It's everybody can earn the points. Um, the only thing is, if you, you can earn double the points. So that's really, really good. Um, take it a step further and become a subscriber to earn double. Um, you can also collect seven all new dinosaurs, buildings, and decorations. If you are a VIP, uh, or sorry, a subscriber now. I don't know. Ooh, what's this? Jurassic Cars! This looks cool! <laughs> I might have to- oh, there it is. Okay, it's not cool. But look at that picture, though. That looks so... Oh, what a disappointment. We should have got some v VIP, some uh, XP, right? So let's have a look. Dinosaurs. Um, we'll scroll all the way to the end. We'll scrub all this way and see if there's any new ones being released. Because there's two new aquatics. Um, and a th I think there's only three new hybrids. Are they only hybrids? I'm not sure. Because there's some there in the other video I'm going to upload over the weekend that haven't that aren't shown in this. So maybe they'll be tournament creatures as well. I don't know. So scrub all the way to the end. And there we go. Gorgosuchus. Hold on the phone. Gorgosuchus. Gorg. Wow. 
So this is the first tournament creature to be hybridized. Wow. So that opens the door for VIP creatures to be hybridized. And if VIP creatures, as you know, are as good as hybrids, like legendary hybrids. So imagine that. Oh, wow. We'll, we are going to have to do this in another episode. And under Sutra send uh, to Jongasaurus. That's okay. What about the aquatics? Are those, like, you can just get them? I mean, every aquatic right now that's being released has had to have been earned in a card pack. And these ones are no different. We've got, yep, yeah, Onka Pristis. And Dolly, Dolly and Okra. Oh, Dolly! That was the Christmas creature from, like, a year ago or two years ago now. In Jurassic Park Builder. Oh, it's a shame it's a super rare. It was a legendary then. So a lot, lot of um, legendaries aquatics have been downgraded to super rares in this game. So, wow, so much news. Um, we'll do the battle for survival and then we'll get the hybrid. We'll get the Nundasuchus hybrid. I think we do have Nundasuchus level 40. I could be wrong. Okay, so we're going to only use two commons. Oh, this is not good. I don't really have that, that good dinosaurs. Only two commons. Um... Utah Raptor and Labyrinthus? This is not looking good! Um I have to go for block, because I'll die if he hits me in two. Oh man, I need I need my hybrids! I need my common hybrids on the go. Ooh, you could kill me. I should have went for two block. Oh no, never mind. He might have went for a reserve. Okay. Don't go for one. If you are going to attack, go for two. Okay, this is good. This is good. Yes, go for two block. Oh, he didn't. He's got five. Mm, can't kill me. Well, it can. And it does. Okay. Right, it's got nothing. We've got eight. Hopefully, we can do this. Right. One, two, three, four. Four. Oh, they've added a glow every time you do a battle now. Every time you put in a, an attack, it gets like a whoa. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, so we have to go for the three block because we can die in two hits. We can almost. Oh! I forgot! Uteraptor nerfed it! Oh my god, he can kill us if he wants to. Oh! <laughs> I didn't even see the health. I didn't even see the health. Oh my god, please go for three again. Please go for three. Don't go for four. Oh my god, we are being so lucky. <laughs> oh, can we kill it in six? Can we kill it in five? We can't kill it in five. Let's do this. Just keep going. Is our luck going to run out? Please don't. Please don't. Please go for three again. Oh, this is weird. Okay, can we kill it in six? Can we kill it in six? I don't think we can. Right, let's do this. Oh, no, this is the first time he's went for five. He's going to go for it. He's going to go for five. Damn it. Oh, no, nah, I'm not going to watch myself die. No, it's not happening. Okay, wow. So, I guess that means we've got to get an Alangosaurus level 20. A Pelicanopter, but it's just a food park. I don't really care about it. But I have to win it. Okay, okay, let's do it. We're going to get a Langasaur level 20. Um, and that should be it, actually. That's all we need. So let's go hybrids. I, I'm being cautious of my DNA, though. Because I... Oh, it's only 26 bucks. <laughs> yeah, never mind. I thought it was, like, going to be quite a hit. But uh, no, it's not going to be. And we don't have anything in the creation lab, either. So we just need this and then a Utah Raptor. And I think we're golden. Right, there we go. First time done. Level 11 to level 20. A one star! Ah! And it gives me... It sort of gives me an excuse to even level this guy up. Yeah, and this guy... This guy, I think, can kill himself almost in two hits. Maybe not. Okay. So what's the other one we need doing? The other hybrid. Let's have a look. We do have a Pelicanopteryx as well. So hybrids... Labyrinth. That's the one. That's the one we need. 
We'll not use it this time. I'm guessing we'll probably use it in the next battle. Like battle two. So let's do this. Well, that's tonight's episode sorted. I, like, literally, it's a day before I go to an ins to insomnia. And I've been, like, I've, I've got five or six videos to edit. And I came back. And this update lands. And I'm like, oh, well, there's a seventh. <laughs> oh, God, it's been nuts. Right. His, la his labyrinth can kill me in two hits. Because it's got, like, 400 attack. So, uh, also, we should just get all the level 20 hybrids that we can that are common. Um, yeah, the pelican optics. That's a good one, actually. I don't mind spending DNA and books on these because it's not too much. And a level 20, I'd rather have a level 20 than a, than a level 10. Because level 10 just sits there doing nothing. At least this level 20, I can sort of use it. A level 40... Um, hybrid common is probably as good as a level 30 legendary, so it's really still not usable. But because we win a pack and we're gonna get double VIP points, I hope, um, or some loyalty points, sorry, my bad, they're not called VIP anymore. Uh, so 600 attack, that's good. Is that everything? I think that might be everything. Ooh. Let's do a battle. So there we go, we're in much better stead this time. Um. Oh. <laughs> Gonna have to buy back Utah Raptor. Wow, okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to go for the block because that Alangosaurus can kill me. I should have put in Utah Raptor first. Right, right, okay. Um, let's go for two block. Yeah, we're gonna survive! Go for two, come on, go on, attack me. Okay, never mind. Uh, three it is. <laughs> Oh no, he's killed me. Yeah, two can kill me. In fact, one can kill me. He'll go for four. Ah, oh, bollocks! This has went even worse! I, yeah, I knew I needed level 30s at least. Um, I'm gonna go for three block. He probably went for one. No, he didn't! Oh, for God. He's gonna go for five and kill me! Oh, for God's sake, really? <laughs> oh, okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Let's do it. The game wants me to. I'll, I'll get two more Alangosauruses. Thank God they're not really not too much of a hit. This is just for food, mind you, but we were, I kind of want to see what this pack holds. Um, and while we're at it, might as well get a level 30 um, Labyrinthus as well. Uh-huh. Okay, that's the level 30. So we need... Two more of you. It's only 1,000 DNA. It really isn't that much. So I'm guessing they've stopped you grinding for DNA because now you have to wait 12 hours to collect it. So instead of it being like the food hopper where it's just constantly gaining it, you have to wait. Oh, what am I doing? No, I'm not ready. And you. Okay, that's it. I think that's two. I might have bought an extra one. I hope I haven't. Because I don't really particularly want a... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna feed it. I'm gonna feed it. Right, Utah Raptor in first this time. Then, um, Alangosaurus or whatever it is. But first, we'll level up these guys. So, are you guys hyped? I'm hyped. I, I, I was hoping that the mammoth was ready, but I kind of knew it wouldn't be. Um, I thought it was just gonna be. Even if it, the update does come out, I had a feeling that. It was going to be the same situation where it's out, like the Mosasaur, except for you can't get it until the tournament's over. Um, fortunately, I managed to get it. I think it was five days left on the tournament, or at least it was quite a long time, but I played the Mosasaur tournament constantly for two days straight. I never stopped, and I finally managed to win it. Um, that was nuts. I, I didn't even sleep. Didn't even sleep. It was disgusting. <laughs> but I just wanted it. I really did. Um, hopefully the mammoth... Um, I won't do that with the mammoth. I'm not that fussed. I was expecting the, the... I think the hype for the aquatic was way higher than the glacier is right now because we didn't know whether we were going to get an aquatic park. We didn't know what we were gonna what was going to happen. But now we know glacier park is not going to happen. We're just going to have a habitat that houses uh, glacier... Uh, creatures. 
Yeah, go on, eat me food. Uh huh, uh huh, yeah, uh huh. These have been done first time every time. That's awesome. Right, you are gonna win this, okay? I'm not gonna be a divvy this time. <laughs> Come on. Can it kill itself in two hits? I think it can, yeah, it definitely can now. I think maybe level 20 it couldn't, but at level 30 it can. Right! Okay, you, you, go. Done. Go for a block, yeah. Might as well. We need the turns. Right. Come on, come on. I've got this this time. We got a. T oh, and he even did attack! Awesome! Oh, that's really good because now we can go for blocks. And he can't touch us. Oh, now it's being aggressive. Okay. Interesting. I still want to see, like, I hope we get a glitch where we can have the Indominus Rex fight a mammoth. That would be so cool. Like, have the Indominus Rex in the glacier exhibit. I hope that happens because that was so cool. I'm going to do that. I don't think it went for a block. No, he didn't. Rum. Now he's got 202. Yeah, he can't kill us in two hits. Please attack. Come on. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah. He loves the threes. So it's got one block. We can kill it in four, right? One, two, three kills it. And then there we go. Sword. And he didn't even block. Ram. Finally, only one left. And we can win it. And let's get this other hybrid, for God's sake. Not the Gorgasuit, although that looks cool. Uh, we'll get the um, Tejongasaur and Nundasuit, that's right. Okay. Ooh, all right, all right. All right, all right. Oh, it's just a normal Argentinosaurus. Um, man. The Alangasaur could kill it in one hit. But I'm not going to do that. It's it's not a hybrid. We may as well not face it with a hybrid. Majung? We'll have Majung and our own labyrinth. Let's do that. I think it may have been three creatures, or if it was two, well, who cares? <laughs> right, he's probably going to switch. We want all the goes for our labyrinthus. Is that even the, is that what it's called? I don't even know. You never look. And also, I've got my fingers crossed for a Jurassic Park Builder Christmas update. The, I mean, there was a leak ages ago where some guy who worked at Ludia put up loads of his, uh, loads of assets that weren't released yet. And, um, oh, what the hell happened to Majungasaurus's fingers? They screwed up on the texture map on that, on the back of it. He's got blue, like, tippies. Right, okay, let's kill it in three hits. One, two, three, factor in one just in case, and there we go, you're dead. Yeah, so... I mean, there was something about, uh, like, digging, like, bone digging and excavating fossils. And there was something else, like a spin wheel. Um, so, be, it, like, and it's still a really active game, I feel. I would still be playing it if um, I didn't, like, have everything done already. Oh, we kill him in one, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, I was a bit worried there. But no, he's dead in one, even if he did block that extra one more time. And that's it, we win a food pack. This is the first time we've seen one of these. How much? How much do you think, guys? A million? Oh, what's with the sound? Da -la -la. Da -la -la. Okay, well, let's go. 125, 125, 125, 125. So that was... Oh, and we got double. Ooh, we got quite a lot of points. So 125,000, 250,000... Half a million. That's not bad. You know, that's not bad. Oh, the VIP points. So now that, you know, the solid gold packs have went up double the cost for VIPs. Really, we win double the VIP points. So it doesn't affect us that much. The only difference is, uh, m like, my total VIP points didn't double. Because then I'd be like, oh, there's no change. And basically, newcomers have a an equal chance to win it. But, um... It's sort of like, from here on out, it's fine, but all the points I've accumulated up until this point have been nerfed. They've been cut in half, which does kind of suck because, you know, the packs have been doubled. Um, I've completely forgotten what I was going to say. <laughs> uh, I, I, yeah, that's right. I wish I'd spent all my VIP points knowing this going in. Um, 
and I, I like uh, and to start from fresh would be nice but who knows maybe over Christmas we'll get some new creatures apparently the seven exclusive creatures that only subscribers can get um, I think is it I mean that's what it said it said seven maybe that's just loyalty though I mean is there seven creatures here like one two three four five six seven eight so the seven more that maybe only VIP peas can get I don't know but now I think it's a welcome addition everybody now can get um, loyalty points and if you upgrade to subscriber or you know VIP because they're still calling it VIP mystery pack your mystery pack gets upgraded so instead of 10 bucks you get 30 bucks so you get almost triple the prizes and you can get that you know every six hours as well as doubling um, VIP points or loyalty points and seven exclusive new dinos maybe and who knows what's in the future so there is still like giant author cone and that is still locked away behind a sort of paywall but they've opened up a lot more opportunities to the people who just want to play without spending money which is really nice um, you can never have enough of that. That's, you know, that's commendable. At least to everyone who's thinking that, you know, Ludia is this money-grabbing company. Hey, they did this. They opened it up. Not all the way, but, um, people are, you know, you've, you've lost nothing. You've, the people who do, haven't paid any money now can get VIP points. And now can get some new creatures. And I think this, this DNA thing, though, I think that's, that's subscriber only. I mean, look at it. The wall's made of solid gold. So yeah. <laughs> As you enjoyed this video, leave a like, and until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye. Oh, hold on. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. My bad. Um, we forgot to do the the hybrid. Oh, I've only got a level twenty under sutures. I promised it though. I can't turn my back on it now. Oh God. How many? No we we surely have. Come, on, we have to get the hybrid. We have to get the hybrid. So, yeah, I'm, I'm not ending the episode. I I do that quite often, actually. I'll say, oh, we'll do this some point in the video, and then I never do it. And it's genuinely because I forget. So I remember just, I was like, I swear to God there was something. <laughs> and I haven't forgotten it this time. <clears throat> and I don't know, what is it, is it going to be a, I think it's a super rare, isn't it? And we can't tell its stats until we get it. So... Hey, let's get it. Oh, did I even show the uh, the mammoth picture? I don't even know if it was in the news. Hold on, hold the phone. Before we do anything, is it in the news? No, it's not even here. Guys, let, let, let's show you. Is it, it's, it's, oh God, yes, not that. <laughs> here it is, look. Uh, there it is. So this... This, you got the normal mammoths to the right, and then to the left, this has to be the level 40. It's got like scratch, it lo they look like scars on its hind legs, or they could be stripes. And we know in Jurassic Park Builder, there was a lot of creatures or glacier creatures that just hit did have stripes on them when they leveled up, which is nice. And the horns, the tusks themselves are a little bit different too. So... Um, I'm really glad that they're not spiky because it wouldn't have fitted in or at least it didn't it doesn't fit in with this sort of creature um, It's nice that we get some coloring added to them It's it's nice variety as well because the aquatics a lot of them do have spikes, but a very f a few of them do have um, What do you call it do have some other different types of coloring um, and it's nice to see that uh, Ooh, I just realized that was an upgraded DNA center wasn't it you had like a not so upgraded DNA center on the hold on where is it on the left and then on the right is a really upgraded one and it looks like you can upgrade it one two three one two three four five six seven eight nine ten times and oh my god it's probably gonna take ages yeah it's pretty it's gonna take loads loads of time to get that I mean I'm guessing the first upgrade is one out of two and then the next upgrade is like you know, out of four, and then eight, and then sixteen. It's gonna probably take ages. I mean, hopefully it's two. So every two days. But that's really quick, actually, if you think about it. So, uh, yes, where were we? We were getting the... <laughs> so this is level 30. We've never had this guy before. Um, probably because there's no real need for it in my park right now. Um, we have 69 of them! <laughs> oh, God. 
That was because I just abused the um, aquatic thing. Uh, it was the aquatic draft battles. Or amphibian draft battles, that's it. I wish it was aquatic draft battles, that would be awesome. Uh, so we've got loads of these. Which is actually really good, because um, I think we've got lots of uh, cat pursuit as, as well. And uh, maybe we can just... No, no, you know what? We use food and more DNA in actually leveling up to level 40 than just outright buying uh, the hybrid. So I think it's always cost effective. The first one, you always have to get a level 40. After that, don't level up another level 40 and fuse it together. Just buy the hybrid out the market. So there's a level 20. So we need two more. And I'm going to save up my food, guys. I don't know, what, I don't know when this mammoth's dropping. I'm, I'm guessing it's not over the weekend. It'll probably be Christmas Eve or some sometime like that. And uh, we'll also get some... I mean, there was a, a hybrid that was a flyer, right? I'll quickly look at the news again. I'm pretty sure there was. Yeah, once I've got this level 40, we'll have a look. Because I am sure there was a flyer. And it looked like it was Dimorphodon and something else. Probably Scappers. And if that's the case, we are looking at an OP flyer. I mean, not as good as Pterodactylus, of course. And uh, actually, after this update, we should check the roster of our strongest dinosaurs. Because there may have been a reshuffle, and some things may have got nerfed. Oh no, do we need... Or is that it? I think that might be it. Yeah, that's it. Okay, we're done. We just get this to level 30, and then we fuse the level 30s together to make level 40. And I got... I don't know what it was. I traded loads in my previous video for bucks. It was either coin or food, and I got 20,000 bucks. And I was like, yes! Awesome! Because that, that's amazing to me. And I like how everything's got a gold outline but now that you're a VIP. I feel richer for looking at it. And you will too if you're watching this video. Which, if you're not watching this video, then... That makes no sense at all. <laughs> you're obviously watching it. If you're, uh, listening to this. Oh my god! <laughs> Come on, dude! You got this. Come on, I've got- I don't have time! It's like 20 to 5 already. And I've only got 5 hours till 10 o'clock. And I've got to edit like 6 videos including this one! And then do the thumbnails and set them off and all ready to go! So here it is. That thing looks cool! So it's a rare and a common, so it, it is only a rare hybrid. That's a shame. But then again... Carnoraptor is a rare hybrid, and he's there with the best of them. And Nundasuchus is a really good um, amphibian. But the only problem here is, Tijongasaurus is quite literally the worst herbivore ever. It's w I think it's it's worse than Triceratops, I think. Oh, it looks cool. I love that. Yeah, let's plonk, plonk it there. Plonk it there. Oh, it's a cutie. Oh, that's adorable. 420 health, 107 attack. So, hold on. This thing has a head of a herbivore, but eats fish? Oh man, I wanted to see this in the herbivore enclosure. You are weird looking, aren't you? You're a frick. <laughs> Let's feed you up. And we'll see what it's like at level 40. So it's definitely a health tank. It does look it. You've got to admit, it's- oh, it's a little chubby! It's beautiful! I love it, it's adorable. Okay, so, um, it'd be cool if they, you know, made a different animation for it and it was in the, um, the uh, herbivore exhibit. I'd be like, oh, cool! So, let's have a look. He should be unlocked, so he should be moved out of the back. There it is, so 4,600. Ooh! Just over half the price of a Carnoraptor, so it's not looking good because Carnoraptor is some good dinosaurs. Um, I think it's Pyraptor and Carnotaurus, which is both rares. Whereas this is a rare and a common. Uh, health is almost the same, but attack. No. Nah. I mean, this thing could take out Carnoraptor. Easy. Um, doesn't nearly get half, uh, half the coin. Actually, you know, it's in three hours, so it does technically gather more than Carnoraptor. Just in a shorter period of time. 4,000 DNA. So if I was to get this to level 
40. I need another 7. Rounded up, say it's 5. Uh, 35,000? 35, 35,000 DNA. Technically, you know, only 33, but 35,000, probably including the speed ups. That's really good. You know, that's better than a legendary. Wow, okay. But I'm wanting to save up for Gorgasuchus. Because that thing looks cool. And I want to see that level 40. So maybe we'll save for that and get that in another episode, I think. We'll, like, we'll wait for time to go by. Because I don't want to just get Gorgasuchus and that be the episode. I kind of want to, you know, do some battles with it. Because there's nothing going on right now. We've just had this drop. Um, and we're just playing the waiting game at the moment. So there's no point in me really getting it. And, you know, I've got to space out these episodes. I've got to, got to, you can't just have the whole jar of honey. You've got to have tablespoons. A little bit. Every day. So now, I, I came through my promise. I did everything. Enjoy the video, guys. I just want to say thank you again for sticking with me on episode 235 or 4 or something like that. It's been one hell of a roller coaster of a journey. And I wouldn't be here without your continued support. And, um... Just the fact that you even bother to watch, which is still like what any YouTuber uh, just wishes. That's what all they want is just to keep you entertained. And you know, as as long as I'm, as long as you're here, I'm doing something right, and I'll just I'll I'll keep doing it. I mean, I I enjoy it, and that's what I've always thought. If I enjoy something, or like it's pe other people I watch on YouTube, I watch it because they enjoy what they're doing. It's pretty easy to see if somebody's faking it or if they have you know they're just like in it for the money or whatever, whatever kind of reason. Um, and back in the day when I was a little channel, I would call out certain people or say, oh, I don't like this guy because I feel like blah, blah, blah. But now that we're almost on a million subscribers, I feel a bit conscious with everything I say now <laughs> because um, not that I, I mean, I, I want us to be a community. Even down the comments, I see every now and again, somebody leaves a comment and you get very sarky comments back to it. It'd be like, no, stupid. I mean, there's no need for that, guys. Like, it, it could be a kid. If it's a kid, then just, like, just be a little bit nicer on them. Because <laughs> I don't want to, I don't want to have, like, I know, I feel like over the years, I don't know where it's came from, but certain people, again, not naming names, <laughs> or just anybody in particular, I've been like, oh, Beaver's fan base, just a bunch of kids, blah, blah, blah. They all go flying off the handle. And actually, you guys aren't. I know for a fact you, for one, well, some of you may be kids, that's nothing wrong with that. But the fact that, like, th this ravenous fan base, that if I say, oh, I don't like that guy, you'd be like, hey, kill him! <laughs> Which isn't the case at all. In fact, I've seen quite the opposite. Um, I went on, like, somebody's channel, and then they've been preparing themselves, like, oh, prepare for the beaver fan base incoming, oh, and then it's just never happened, because there's no point. And I, like, I feel like a bit of my humanitarian, like, I, faith in humanity has been restored in that sort of sense, and I've been like, you know what, yeah, you guys are awesome, and you've supported me, it's only been, like, two years, guys. I've only had this channel for, you know, we're coming up to two years now. Um, in fact, I think we're a tiny bit over, but Jesus, in two years, a million subscribers. I feel like I should, I, I know what I'm going to do. And for me, it makes sense, but I feel like there's a pressure that like on a million subscriber special to do something really amazing. But if you think about it, there's a lot of channels out there that do get a million subscribers and now... We know that 1 million subscribers doesn't technically mean I have a million active viewers. Because that's not the case at all. There's not a million people just waiting for a video. In fact, probably half. There's probably, you know, half a million. So for me to celebrate a million subscribers feels a bit like... I don't know. They're not... It's not really a million. I mean, communitively, yeah, there is a million. But with YouTube acting up the way it is, sort of killing certain channels, or at least that's the rumor, and... Stuff like that. I don't know. I don't feel like celebrating it. <laughs> I mean, I'm so grateful. I really am. But at the same time, there's certain things in the way that I'm like, well, actually, there's people out there that deserve a lot more recognition and stuff. And YouTube needs to fix this sort of thing. And the fact that, you know, we've been going... If it was a million subscribers in a week, 
then yes, there would be a million there. But we, we've been going for two years and some people, you know, they'll be in for a certain, like, series, like Primal Far Cry Primal, and then they'll go. Once that's finished, they'll go, and that's completely fine. Um, for the guys that, you know, for you guys, I mean, I noticed people that loved my Pokemon Go episode, because it was like a parody, and I, lo I had loads of fun doing it, but they don't watch this sort of thing, and that's completely fine. Um, you don't have to watch every video I make, but I'm just saying that there's, you know, there's, again, there's not one million there. But, and also there's, I've seen comments, I'm sorry, I'm going on a complete tangent. It's Beaver Real Talk time before he sits down in complete silence for five hours and edits and listens to himself. Send help. <laughs> um, and there's been people in the comments saying, help Beaver, he really needs all these subscribers, he needs to reach a million by the end of the year. And my goal is a million by the end of the year, whether we hit or not, hit it or not is not the point. We got to a certain amount of subscribers and that is to be commended. Like, that's amazing. It's I can still not believe that that... My, I, I don't look at my subscriber count and think it's real. It's just numbers to me now. I can't imagine 900,000 people at all. I mean, I, I probably need to Google and have like, this is what 900,000 people looks like because it just becomes numbers after a while and... Maybe we'll do something like a live stream and we'll get- I want to get more in touch with you guys because I feel like a lot of the time it is just the game. And really I should be making a vlog about this. And maybe I will at some point. Um, but uh, yeah guys, I just want to say thank you so much. You've made like- This is my job now. My love is my job. And I now have so much time for other things in my life. I can enjoy my life like to certain things like- I was going to go into animation, and I know, like, I would have loved it still, but the pressure would have been so much. And YouTube pressure is intense in different ways, but now I can go back to animation and just take my time and enjoy it and do what I want. Do what I love um, in my spare time. And, y like, you you don't even know. You, you don't even know, <laughs> like, the amount of doors you guys have opened, like, working with Disney, um, and like being part of insomnia like being on stage and meeting so many cool people like my heroes in a way as well like i got to meet oni i had a really nice conversation with him at like a party um i've met um i met jacksepticeye i've had a talk with him i wouldn't say we're best buddies but you know i had a talk with him and that's all like that's all i cared about i didn't want to be best chums i don't i don't even really know the guy but the fact that i could even just like sit down with him or, you know, you know, st stand next to him um, and just chat, like, one-on-one, -on -one, not have a, like, a sort of, you know, I'm a subscriber fanboy sort of thing going on in my head it was really nice. And um, I've got so much... It it's all because of you guys. And it's so sappy, I know. I'm so sorry. <laughs> but it's true. It really is. And um, thank you so much. So, guys, <clears throat> if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time... I'll see you later. Bye-bye.